What's up guys, Redder901007 here. Um, as you can see by this massive box here, uh, at least it's the biggest one I've ever got, I have an unboxing vendor review for you guys today. Um, I've been waiting for this one for a little while. This is my order from 5 Star. Many of you have probably seen it up on the forums, exactly what I ordered. So now you're going to get to see me open it. This is the third time I'm doing an unboxing for 5 Star. This is the third time I've ordered from them. Um, right off the bat, this box is pretty banged up. You can see here, um, the corners squished in pretty good. You know, but everything still seems sealed very well. But yeah, it's it's beat up really good. Um, this took a bit longer than usual to get here. They shipped it out on a, a Friday afternoon, um, which was the 16th. Uh, today is the 28th. So there you go. That's it's been uh, 12 days. That's over two weekends, so nine business days. My kind of that Friday eight business days. Usually it takes five, whatever. Not a big deal. Now usually I have not a single thing to complain about for five star. There's only one small thing that's bothering me here. Um, the uh, the postage on this was under forty five dollars. It was about forty four, and they charged me fifty two for it. I know packing can be expensive also, so you know what? Really not a big deal. That's not going to lose any points. Um, let's just go ahead and open this up. Should be pretty easy on this one. Yeah. The ends are, uh, like I said, they're banged in pretty good. Ugh. So yeah, no, uh, no, didn't get stuck at customs or anything. I didn't have to wait any longer. There was a few issues with the order, um, which were sorted out very nicely by Mary over at Five Star. I'll get into that when I actually get the items. Okay, so keep that over here. Hope you guys can see this well. Um, it was a fairly big order. The total of the order was $274. Uh, the shipping, like I said, they charged me $52 for it. So it's about, you know, uh, it's over $200, $229. Pretty big. However, this was split between a few people. I'm not going to say who was for what, but all the Tangiers was for me along with uh, Najumho. Some, some stuff. You'll see what's in here. Anyway, um, as usual for 5 Star, fucking ton of packing peanuts. So, I'm going to try and do this without making too much of a mess. So right here I see a diffuser. I ordered two of these. There they are. Okay. One is for me, one's not. Um, just the usual ones, the uh, hookah diffusers from Sahara Smoke. These are the large ones. They fit great on a cam. Some of you have asked me about that in the past on the forms. Um, okay, here's some gifts. Okay, they sent me uh, this is two 50 round packs of Shisha on the Beach. Uh, I'm not too excited about this. I have some of this still. I actually just traded some away. Uh, maybe there's something else in there. I don't know. The fact that they sent me two of the same is kind of odd. I did actually ask them because I'm splitting this order with my cousin to throw in something special for him. So maybe that's what they threw in. Uh, here's something in bubble wrap. This could be a bowl. Um, I did order, not for me, for someone else, one of the chipped Egyptian bowls, which cost a dollar on their site, which is a great deal. Um, which Packaged nice in a lot of bubble wrap. This might be a pretty long video, guys, just because there's a, a lot of things in here, like a lot. This is really tough to open. Okay, so yeah, this definitely looks like an Egyptian. Yeah, it is. Oh my god, okay, this is uh, this is a really good shape. A lot of you have asked me, um, you know, ordering from Five Star, is it a good deal to get the chipped Egyptian bubbles? Um, let me show you how this is chipped. Just the glaze up on the top here, if you guys can see that. From the top, you barely see it. Um, I don't think that's going to affect the quality of the smoke from this. This is a really nice bowl, actually. Very shallow. Um, yeah, this is going to be a great smoke. It's not for me, but uh, for another member. So that's a, that's a good buy for him, actually. I'm glad that worked. Uh, here, this is, oh, this one's nice. This is uh, the KM Quad Metal Wind Cover. This is for my cousin, actually. Let me uh, open this. I don't want to scratch the paint or anything. Oh, this is actually gorgeous. I've never seen one of these in person before. Um, it looks like a very nice size. It's filled the inside with peanuts. Okay, come on. And I'm gonna. So this this covering, uh, this plastic is on there, I guess, from the factory. Um, it's a nice size. It will definitely fit over a Tangier's bowl or something. Uh, it looks huge, and it's really, really nice looking as well. 
It's a bit uh, dusty on the inside, but a quick little cleaning. The colors on this are really nice. I, it's not for me, unfortunately. I, I didn't feel like spending this much money on a wind cover, but this is a great investment. Very good thing. Um, here's a fancy hose I see floating around up here. A blue one. Oh, hey, what do you know? Free gift from Five Star. Thank you guys. I absolutely love fancy hoses. Um, sick. I see another one floating here too. I ordered one. They're both gifts. Two free fancy hoses. So here's the gift so far. Half the set I've taken out as gifts. 100 grams of Nakashisha on the beach. Two fancy hoses. Five Star. Thank you very much. Not even done yet. Um, I'll get into the hose ordeal shortly, actually. Uh, here's some more wrap stuff. Oh, crap, this thing is massive. This is also for uh, my cousin. This is the uh, KM tr Extra Large Tray. Oh my gosh. This is actually very nice. Look at this. Um, with the nice gold trim. This is one of the nicest ones I've seen. Hang on a sec, guys. Let me just compare this to my... Uh, this is your standard KM tray. This is this one. Look at the size difference. It fits right into it. Um, this is a gorgeous, gorgeous tray. I really want one of these. And it has the same opening. A few people also have been asking about, will this fit all KMs? Uh, the same opening. So this will fit. Also, it's made to fit a chiller, I think, too. I'm jealous. This is fucking nice. Um, put that over here. Okay, this is the most one of the things I ordered for myself that I was very excited about. Um, this is the Nojum hose. Uh, this one uh, is the silver and black one. Let me take it out of the packaging for you guys. Like I said, this video is going to drag on. It's already seven minutes in. I'm sorry, guys. There's just so much in here. If you guys don't want to watch the whole thing, just skip through it. I don't care. So, comes with instructions on how to clean it, which is good because some people don't know. Um, smells kind of plasticky right out of it. Seems a little stiff, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna just wash it before I use it. But it looks really nice. It looks real nice. This is my first uh, removable tip hose. So, uh, cool. So now here's the story about this is I ordered it and they were actually out of stock. However, still had it up on the website. They uh, told me, you know, we don't have it, I'm really sorry. Right away, they didn't have to wait too long. They, I just sold 20 of them to someone over in Europe. They called the, up the guy from Europe, said, look, we made a mistake on the website, would you mind taking one out of your order? Right away, the guy said, sure. He took it out of his box, threw it in mine. Thank you, Five Star. Um, another story about how great their service is coming up soon. It's just hard to get through all these peanuts, but I haven't even gotten to the, to the tobacco yet. Ah, uh, here's another bowl. Where's my box cutter? This should be the unglazed Egyptian. Not for me, again, uh, I already have one of these, but not from Five Star, but this looks good. Very well packaged. Okay, so it's a bit smaller than the, uh, the other one, but it's very nice. This is fairly new for Five Star. Unglazed, um, yeah, it's fairly shallow. This should smoke great, actually. If you guys wanna see that. Uh, here it is compared to the chipped one, so the size is a bit smaller. I'm going to try and speed things up a little. What's this? Okay, um, 250 grams of Starbuzz Simply Mint. Not for me, obviously. But it does smell good. I will give it that. It smells really good. But Starbuzz, I wouldn't buy it. You guys would be better. Here is another Nojum hose. This is the... Uh, goldish brown one, not for me though, the silver one's for me. Did you get into tobacco yet or what? Okay, uh, here is two different Fumaris, this is Blueberry Muffin and Mint Chocolate Chill. Ah, uh, there's the stuff I wanted. Um, Tangiers baby, Tangiers Noir, Maraschino Cherry, Watermelon, and there should be another one in there. Cashmere Peach. Um, with the Tangiers, they actually didn't have the flavors I was looking for. Um, and they actually called up Tangiers to see when they'd be getting more. And uh, they actually added the Maraschino Cherry in after the order. Awesome stuff. Okay, I see more tobacco in here. This is, uh, yeah. Here's a 50 gram. Uh -oh. Okay, hold on. Uh, 50 gram uh, double apple. 250 gram Nakla mixed cosmopolitan. However, 
it's really it's leaking out. Um, you just can see how the color in the corner there. So it leaked. Uh, this is the first time this has happened to me. Uh, I can't really blame Five Star for this. I mean, it was packaged very well. I don't know what happened. It's kind of on my fingers now. What else do we got? 50 gram of Napa Cosmopolitan. Yes, my 50 gram box of Zagul. 250 grams of Nakla Miso Mints. Um, that might be it, actually. I'm not sure. Yeah, let me just dig around a little more. But that should fulfill the whole order. That was a really long video, guys. I'm already at 11 minutes. I'm just gonna go over it really quickly. Okay, so that's it. You guys can see my bed is covered in stuff. Um, this is just copied the invoice I have, so. Tobacco. Um, for me, there was all the Tangiers flavors along with the Zagul. Uh, let me just lower this so you guys can see a bit better. So yeah, there is, that's for me. Um, for my cousin, I ordered him the Cosmopolitan, the Miso Mint, and Fumagus Blueberry Muffin. Great, great flavor, guys. Um, for Theo X69, Star Buzz is Simply Mint. Mint Chocolate Chill by Fumari. Um, he also got, no, that, I think that's he got, yeah. Um, then there's the 50 gram boxes for another member, along with his chip bowl. Um, for my cousin stuff again, there's the unglazed, and the zoom hose, the wind cover, the tray. This is, oh, I'm so impressed by this tray, guys. This is such a nice tray. Um, diffusers, minor zoom hose. And of course, free gifts from Five Star. Again, thank you guys so much. You did so much on this order for me. Two 50 gram boxes of Nakla's Shisha on the Beach. I will probably be giving these to some of the other members since I've tried this already. And two fancy hoses. You guys made up for any delays I had so much. This is These are worth about $3 each. That's $6, these are about $5 each. Okay, $16 or $17 worth of free stuff. Um, Thank you guys so much. Alex and Mary, you're one of my all-time favorite vendors. You always make things right, even if there's problems that aren't your fault at all. Um, definitely a 10 on 10 for these guys. Sorry this video was so long, but look at the crap load of shit I just took out from this box. So yeah, check out 5 Check out hookahpro.com, your ultimate source for everything hookah. Thanks, guys.